Ex-USA gymnastics coach John Getter died by suicide hours after being charged with sexual assault and human trafficking. I'm giving you the shocking details right now. Hi everybody, it's Devin Howard. If you wanna follow me on Instagram, you can find me there as at Devin Howard. Double check that you've subscribed to The Fumble, tap the bell for notifications, and don't forget to hit the thumbs up button. John Getter coached the 2012 US Women's Gold Winning Olympic Team and worked very closely with Larry Nasser, who was convicted of criminal sexual misconduct and child pornography. John was also charged with crimes including sexual assault, human trafficking, and running a criminal enterprise. He was accused of using his Michigan gym to coerce young girls to train under him, and then he would verbally and physically abuse them. Attorney General Dana Nessel said that John used force, fraud, and coercion for financial benefit. He tortured the girls so severely that a lot of them suffered from eating disorders, including anorexia and bulimia. They made suicide attempts, self-harmed, and were subject to excessive physical conditioning. They were forced to perform even when they were injured as well. John put them through extreme emotional and physical abuse, including sexual assault. Just reading all of that makes me nauseous. These girls were so traumatized and violated by a person that they were supposed to be able to trust, a person who was in a position of power. This is disgusting. John was set to have his day in court, but that won't be happening after his body was found on Thursday, hours after he was charged with 24 counts of criminal misconduct. He took his own life to avoid facing the repercussions for all of the trauma that he caused those girls. The attorney general said, quote, many of these victims still carry these scars from this behavior to this day, and now they're not going to get the closure they were so desperately hoping for. This was truly the cowardly move for John, but hopefully his victims can find peace in knowing he won't harm anyone else. Send some love to the women in the comments, please. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and tap the bell. I'm Devin Howard for The Fumble, and I'll see you guys later.